Good morning, Malala Library patrons. Welcome to Baby Bounce. My name is Becca, and I'm so glad to have you here at my home today. This is Dolly, and she's going to be representing my baby. And that, this is great for you and your um, children, ages zero to two, or and even for your older children. They can um, enjoy these songs and rhymes and finger plays as well, but also they can um, follow along with us with their own dolls or cars or trucks or whatever item they would like to bring with them for these um, activities. So today we've got some more nursery rhymes to do and the first one is a bounce. Remember when you bounce your child, make sure you support their head and make sure you don't shake them too hard. We want to make sure that everyone is safe when we do these activities. The first nursery rhyme we have today is called right away and it is a bounce. You can bounce your child gently up and down and it also deals with sides, left side and right side. You can also um, do arms, legs, ears, sides, cheeks, but it's um, to focus on different sides of the body. But it goes right away, right away, Dolly shall right away. She shall have a pussy cat tied to one side and you can touch different sides of the one side of her body. And then she shall have a little dog tied to the other. And you can touch different parts of her other side of her body. And then it finishes, baby shall ride to see her grandmother. And if you don't want to go see grandmother, you can go see someone else. It doesn't have to rhyme perfectly. So let's try that again. Right away, right away, baby shall right away. She shall have a pussycat tied to one side. She shall have a little dog tied to the other. And Dolly shall ride to see her grandmother. And oftentimes it's fun to end with a little tickle or maybe a little zerber on her tummy. So that one can be lots of fun. And oftentimes it's good to remember to whatever you do to one side of the body, it's always good to follow and mirror it up to the other. So that's how a lot of times babies learn best by mirroring, especially as they get older to toddlers. The second rhyme um, you can do as a rhyme, nursery rhyme, you can do as a rhyme or you can do as a song to um, Twinkle Twinkle Little Star, which is a, um, a tune that most all of us know. But it goes, it's way high up in the apple tree, which is hopefully um, a rhyme that most of us know. But you can take your baby's arms and go way high up in the apple tree. I see an apple looking at me. Shook that apple as hard as I could. Down came the apple and you can take your baby down to the ground. And then, mmm, rub their tummy. It was good. Yum. And you can talk about what kind of apples they like to eat if they like to eat apples. If they don't like to eat apples, what else does your child like to eat that grows on a tree? You can change it to way high up in, the apple, in a peach tree or an apricot tree. So if they like a different food than apples, switch it to that. You don't have to follow the rhyme exactly. And if they get older, you can do way high up in the apple tree, I see three apples. And you can count down, looking at me. I shook that tree as hard as I could. Down came one apple. Mmm, it was good. Way high up in the apple tree, I saw two apples looking at me, shook that tree as hard as I could. 
down came one apple. Mmm, it was good. Way high up in the apple tree, I saw one apple looking at me. I shook that tree as hard as I could. Down came the apple. Mmm, it was good. Way high up in the apple tree, <gasps> no little apples are looking at me. Mmm, so yummy. We ate them all up. So you can do subtraction too. These nursery rhymes are uh, put in the first places that your child will do it, basic addition and subtraction. So that's a fun thing to do. So hopefully you'll enjoy those two rhymes with your child and hopefully um, we will see you again next week. Have a great week. Bye-bye you guys.